Hey, what's up guys? It's Andrew and today I'm going to be showing you how to use the app Theme DIY. Now what this app does is it lets you create pretty simple themes for Sand Engine Mod 12's theme engine. Now you won't be able to apply icon packs and wallpapers and the actual like, theme style all in one. You're only going to be able to apply this style. Now that does is it changes your theme to either a material light or dark theme. And you could also change the accent color. So in your settings app, the stuff that is usually this teal color would be a completely different color um, that you choose yourself. Now this is a beta app so you will not be able to download it directly from the Google Play Store. You actually have to go to Google Plus and join the community. The community is called the same thing as the app so all you have to do is search for a theme DIY and then after you join the community you'll be able to use the Google Play Store link to download it so you go ahead and click on that and then it'll open up the Google Play Store. I'm already a tester, so all I have to do is click on download the theme, DIY, and then after it's downloaded, go ahead and open it up. Now, when you first open it up, you gotta be seeing this screen right here. Now, all you have to do to create a new theme is tap the plus icon at the bottom, and you could have to select your base. You could either choose a material light or dark. Um, the light is just a regular stock white background for everything, and the dark would be a dark gray, but you could also switch it to a completely black theme uh, later on throughout the setup. So you just select your base and then you have to select your accent color. They're going to give you a bunch of lists. The, the background will change to show you the actual color that you're going to be switching it to. After you select one, click next and then you're going to have a bunch of options to select from. Now you're going to have to select every color and set it because if you don't it will not let you scroll down to the next option. So all you have to do is just select the defaults and then you'll be able to go to the next section and then you'll continue doing that for a couple more screens and then at this last screen right here you're going to have to choose if you want your apps to be themed as well if you do theme your apps everything for that app will be changed and none of the stock um, navigation bar or status bar color changes will take effect anymore so it'll give your theme a more cohesive look and feel so after you select if you want it to be themed or not go ahead and click on build this will build your theme into an APK that you could install directly from the app and it will be available in the theme section of your settings app. Alright, now that it's done building, go ahead and click install. It'll install as the theme DIY dark template. All you have to do is click next. Click next one more time and then click install. Now you're only able to install two themes at a time. So if you want to make more than one dark theme you won't be able to you can only make one light and one dark if you do want to create a different dark kind of theme all you have to do is go into your app manager and then delete the original dark theme and you'll be able to create another one in a future update the developer will allow you to create more themes and also give you a way to export them so you can share them with your friends or on a different forum all right so now that it's installed you go ahead and go to your settings app go to your theme section and then look for the theme called dark template. You will not see a preview image and you will only be able to apply the style. After you do that, go ahead and click apply. And then once it's finished applying, I'd recommend that you reboot your phone because there's a possibility that you get a couple forced closes here and there and you, your phone won't feel as smooth as it usually is. Just go ahead and reboot. Once your device reboots, your theme would already be in place. Go ahead and bring down your quick settings and see that they're themed along with going into your settings app and seeing that you have a completely different color scheme. Again, if you don't like the way it turned out, you go ahead and create a different theme by deleting your old one and then creating a new one. And after that, you, you could just start tweaking all the different sections to get the color scheme that you really want. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for this video. Be sure to check out the full guide linked in the description below. And like always, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good one, guys.